Hey guys, Irene here and today I have a fun video for you guys. I'm going to be transforming another one of my thrifted dresses and today's dress is this 80s wedding gown. Looks something like this on me. Um, if you are on my Patreon, you would have already seen this dress as I posted pictures of all of the thrift finds that I got from my last shopping trip. This dress was only $25 and it also came with the veil. Let me actually show you guys the veil. So this is the veil. Oh my god. It's like falling apart and it's very, very old-fashioned, I think. It should go something like this. I don't think I'm gonna use the veil the way it is, but I might use this beautiful lace for something. And the veil itself is really nice, I really like the lace and the detail over here. So what I really liked about the dress is all of the lace detailing and the sleeves. I absolutely love puffy sleeves like that and this very dainty, beautiful lace. So. The only thing is that it's very old-fashioned and I don't like the high colors. It looks, yeah, very old. So what we're gonna do today is we're gonna cut all of this off, leaving just the lace. And I'm gonna also transform this into a choker. It's gonna be very, very easy, but I just wanted to show you guys how you can transform an old-fashioned dress that you can find at the thrift store into something that you can then use for your photo shoot. So what I'm gonna do right now is I'm gonna carefully cut off this see-through part from the lace using the small scissors. I'm starting at the back and I'm gonna be cutting through the zipper. Just make sure that this is at the very bottom. Now I'm gonna do the same to the collar. I'm just gonna separate it from here because I'm actually gonna turn it into a choker. It already has the clasps at the back, so we don't have to worry about that. The only thing that I'm gonna do is I'm gonna attach a piece right here in the very middle. But first, I'm just I'm gonna cut it off over here. So now I'm going to go ahead and attach this pendant to the choker right here. And all I'm going to do is I'm going to make a little tiny hole at the very bottom here. Attach one of these loops and then attach the pendant to the loop. And this way I'm going to make sure that these two parts stay attached together. So now after we shorten the zipper, we don't have this stopper anymore on the dress. So we're going to make our own using needle and thread. So this is the piece from the actual dress. And I'm just going to go ahead and start threading it at the very end through the zipper, just like so. I'm just going to make sure that we're putting a lot of loops through. So that it creates a barrier for the zipper and it doesn't just slide off. So hopefully you guys can see the amount of threads that I put. But I pretty much put enough so it covers the little teeth of the zipper right here. And after you're done, just go ahead and cut it off after you secure it nicely. And this should prevent the zipper from sliding off. I'm going to do the same exact thing on the other side of the zipper. Okay, so now both sides have the thread on and if you try to zip it up, the zipper stops and yeah. So this is pretty much it, let's just put it on and see what it looks like. So 
So this is it. This is what it looks like now. I really, really love it. You can put it more up on the shoulders like this to create this kind of line. Or you can pull it down and have your shoulders like this. You can also now take this off or have it on because it perfectly matches the dress. I'm also thinking maybe to dip dye the dress and have the bottom to be a different color and then like ombre into a different color. I don't know if I'm going to do that yet. Please let me know you guys if you think I should dye it a different color. And if you do, let me know what color should I dye it or maybe I should leave it just like it is. I am in love with this lace. I think the dress is just a lot more delicate now and I just absolutely love shoulders and I think they're super sexy especially in the pictures so yeah it's just gonna fit my style a lot better I hope you guys enjoyed this video I know this was really really quick but I just wanted to show you how you can transform something old into something new and more romantic I do these things all the time I buy the dresses that would not look maybe that great in real life but with few tweaks and uh, if you're using it for a photo shoot, it's gonna look absolutely amazing. So yeah, don't forget to subscribe to my channel, give this video a like, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!